Hello guys, so the last big update was quite underwhelming, not because of Valve surprisingly, as a smaller update this one was quite good, but it was badly received because of hype that was made around all those leaks that we got before. For investors this is also not a good information, because a new operation this time would be a perfect for the market, in opposite to the last one Riptide, where the market crashed. So in today's video I'm gonna tell you why the market till the operation isn't going to change direction, and also why this time operation won't crash the market, but in my opinion will have a positive effect. But before we start I would like to show you sponsor of today's video, which is sellyourskins.com, where you can fast, easily and most importantly safely sell your skins for real money. You just simply log in with your Steam account, choose skin you are willing to sell and pick one of many cash off methods, such as bank transfer, PayPal or even crypto. Also remember to put code iTrust before selling your skins, as it gives you 5% withdrawal bonus. Link will be in the description below. So let's go 3 years back. In September we got a new Riptide operation, just 4 months after the end of Broken Frank operation. Yes, gap between those two was 4 months, and since Riptide we have been waiting almost 3 years. The Riptide operation crashed the market for a few months, because as we know a lot of people were selling skins, cases and stickers to buy operation passes, buy stars to open collections and just buy new skins. And it is natural that when there are let's say 100 more skins, demand for previous skins will be lower, and it should decrease prices of old items just as Riptide did. But this time I think opposite can happen, because right now we lack new content, in opposite to 2021, when we got Riptide just 4 months after end of Broken Fang, that was a lot of skins in short period of time, and since then we got 4 new cases, through 3 years, only 4 cases, so definitely we do not have too many new items, and new stuff would be welcomed by community, because many people do not play CS now because they are bored, as we haven't got any new stuff for a very long time so I think people can be back as new update hits. Of course, some people are going to sell items, because not everyone wants to deposit more just to buy pass, some will sell old skins, but overall I think hype will make more players to buy even old skins. Of course new operation means new skins, new skins means new sticker crafts, so naturally bigger demand for stickers. Also there's a lot of rumors about full agent customization, and that for sure will boost agent skins and in addition patches which maybe would have custom placement like they did with stickers few months ago. Also do not forget about that, summertime isn't a good period for any market. There is this famous proverb, sell in May and go away. Many people in summer doesn't care about markets, investing, playing games, they just go outside, and this as I said is for all markets, not only CS, and also for all games. Also remember that recently we were doing Steam summer sale, which also made people to sell skins, to get these cheap games. And that would be it for today's video, thank you all for watching and see you in the next one.